Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Rich Hedge Hunt. In front of us, we have a book and a bag of £2 coins. Um, first off, about this bag, I can't make sense of this sort code, so I have no idea where it's from. It's not a local bag, but I can't track that sort code down. So, anyway, we got the book out because last time we did find ourselves the Olympic centenary. So we're down to five now, two of the Commonwealths. Uh, we've got Wales and we've got Scotland, so um, we need the Beijing handover, the Mary Rose, and surprisingly, the Great Fire of London. Either of the errors would be nice, but I have noticed a severe lack of Navy centenaries turning up lately, so maybe it's about time people realise that they are actually quite rare and worth more than whatever people are paying for them these days, two, three, three per fifty or whatever. Anyway, that's my rant. Bag of sea, uh, rollover bags inside. As you can see, all nicely sealed. I uh, no idea where it's from, but it's from early April, as far as the date goes. Okay, let's just get on with it. You know what we're looking for. You know we're not going to count the bags. I hope it's 25 there. Put that off that side there. Pile those up a little bit there. Right, let us zoom in just a smidge. There we are. And we crack on on the first bag. Technologies. Not really much interest in those. Um, I will check them all later. Looking for any rotation errors I can find. That's not a bad condition, 99. Put that to one side. Anyway. And of course I am looking for a date run material to finish the date run off. That first bag. Generally the best. Oops. As is the second. That's a very nice condition, 13, to be fair. But, um, oh. Our first commandment is Mr. Grinnell. No edge inscription there. Lost faith in this already, you know. God. Loud, noisy, noisy cars. 98, mm, not bad condition. No, I don't know. Not the best. Another one. Centenary again. I think it's nicer than the uh, than the one we had last week. I might be swapped out. I don't know. 
That was quite unexpected. I thought it was going to go all up. Oh. Looks we've got a couple here. That's going to be something. What's that going to be? Boom! Great fight over and then. One for the book. We'll take that. Thank you very much. Oh, God. Another Brunel. Correct inscription. That was quite unexpected. Very well. Especially the Great Fire of London. We've been an awful long time for that, to be fair. But then, it's another one for the book. We'll have it. Thank you very much indeed. Nothing else in there. I must have a sweet patina. That's all it is, though. It's shiny. 2015 Technologies. Ooh, boom. Trinity House. Now, in that condition, and it is pretty nice condition, I would consider keeping that. It's borderline, I would judge, um, over face value. Especially in nice condition, which that one is, to be fair. So, maybe 250 for it. But uh, again, it's a sleeper, that one. In my opinion. Gunpowder plot. Shiny one, it's just going to be a technology, so I mean, it's a 2011 technology, so mm. I've got to it, it's probably better. Nothing of any proper interest, though. There are we five bags after this one? We've done all right. There's so few commemoratives. But quality over quantity every time. First World War, Army Centenary, King and Country, no rotation. Nothing further. One, two, three, oh. Four left after this one, more than I thought.
nothing there. Nothing in that bag. Three to go. Oh, that's final bag. No rotation now. And nothing else. Well, what can I say? Um, there's not an awful lot there, is there? But with those two, honourable mention, probably, for the uh, Trinity House. But we've got another book filler. I say we have waited an awful long time for this. And it is a beautiful coin, to be fair. Yeah. So, oh, being as I've got the book here, is it okay? Oh, yes, it is. Well, I don't know. Not that much of a difference, to be fair, but we will. Put the great fire in there. So mintage of one point six million. So low, really, for a two pound coin. That of course the mintage was reduced on that one. So there we are. Another space in the book. Four to go. Six if you count the errors, but we don't, because they are errors. So, there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. A few other bits and pieces from old heads there. But, as you see, just Northern Ireland, England, Beijing, and Mary Rose to go. So I'm a happy bunny. Right, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next hunt. Bye for now.